When I went to work in the court, oh, I was so alarmed and what a shock to see the these divorce cases and all. So I said, no, this can't be. Because it's the women and children who suffers. I said, we must do something to stop this. So I went all out to see that this divorce rate is brought down. It cannot be. Women and children must not suffer. Oh, but that was a tough time. The men were very angry and they said all sorts of things. They wanted, wanted to run me out of Singapore and what not. But I stuck to it and said no. I told the few women who were with me, we must do something. We must help these poor, unfortunate women and children. We fought and went on and on and went to the government with our resolution and all that. In the end, the government accepted. And that was a wonderful thing for the women and children. Slowly, the divorce rate came down. That was a very good thing. Very sad, you know, to see the women and children thrown out without money, without anything. Those days, no law. There was no law and order. Lots of struggle, lots of of opposition we had to face, but still we carry on. Otherwise, if we don't carry on, we don't do it, who's going to do it? Who's going to help all these poor women and children? So we carried on and no, no matter what they did, what they said, we just don't care. <laughs> Perhaps it's in me to go out and help. That's, I think that's the thing, that I want to go out and help people, especially those underprivileged and those who have been suffering and all that. It's, it's, I think it's all in the person. Now.